Good evening, this is Luke Thomas Holmquist here at the Earthquake Forecast Center. It is 9.57 in the evening on Monday, October 11th, 9.57 p.m. on Monday, October 11th, and uh, cons very concerned about the area northwest of Los Angeles. <clears throat> First, let's take a look at the uh, earthquake that happened up near Anchorage, Alaska. And uh, take a look at it here, 6.9, I believe, right here. 6.9 earthquake occurred uh, southwest of Anchorage. And if you watched our video yesterday, we were concerned about this peak here, 100% risk on October 11th. And that's when that quake hit on October 11th, uh, early in the morning. And there it is. You can see uh, the map, forecast map here. Uh, the quake hit just southwest of Kodiak. And our forecast map had the, right in that uh, red area, the very high, highest risk area there is where the 6.9 earthquake hit. And just briefly now in, in Alaska, the risk is right now over in the, uh, in the, uh, on the 11th or the 12th and 13th is uh, just south of Juneau and southeast of Anchorage. And then the risk diminishes on the 13th and the 14th more offshore than anything else. <clears throat> and here's a new uh, forecast risk graph for Alaska. But let's get right to the uh, Los Angeles forecast and the warning there. Looking for a major earthquake northwest of Los Angeles here. Uh, during the next 48 hours or so, most likely on the morning. I think there's a graph here. Yeah, most likely in the morning of the 13th, sometime in the morning. However, it can hit any time in the next uh, 48 hours. You can see that's the highest risk there. And it should hit on the Garlock Fault, most likely. We've been getting some foreshocks on the Garlock Fault, the 3.7 that hit a little while ago, uh, hit on the Garlock Fault as well. Uh, so expecting this northwest of LA, it could hit anywhere in that area from Ridgecrest to uh, northwest of LA, Los Angeles as well, all the way up to Coalinga. So there's a quite a big area there, most likely northwest of L LA near the uh, Garlock Fault. And that's coming up during the next 48 hours. Uh, so if you have friends or family that live in that area from LA to Ridgecrest to Coalinga, looking for a strong earthquake, a major earthquake, likely northwest of LA during the next uh, 48 hours. All right, so uh, you can check these maps over at quakeprediction.com. And once again, in the Anchorage area, we got that uh, 6.9 right in this uh, peak here, 80% risk on the 13th, 60% on the 14th, and 70% on the 17th right there. So uh, those are risks coming up. Athens, Greece. The risk is uh, right now uh, the 11th, 12th, and 13th, right here, just west of Athens, Greece. Uh, right there is the highest risk. And then on the 13th and the 14th, very high risk up in northern Greece, right there in that 98% risk there, northern Greece on the 13th and 14th. And then uh, in Italy and Croatia, this is uh, kind of centered near Croatia here on the 12th and 13th. Uh, we could get a significant earthquake in this uh, dark red area here on the 12th or 13th of October. And that's mostly centered over Croatia. Northeast uh, Italy, also very high risk there. And then on the uh, 14th, it gets pretty quiet across Italy, but uh, the highest risk right now is uh, on the 12th and the 13th, right there in the Northeast Italy and around Croatia. All right, and let's check on the uh, forecast for uh, New Zealand. We added New Zealand today. This is the 11th and 12th, far Northeast uh, New Zealand on the 11th and the 12th. And then the uh, 13th and the 14th, mostly moderate risk and all the high risk is offshore. So the greatest risk right now is uh, in Northeastern uh, New Zealand on the 11th and 12th. And in uh, Japan, 
right now, the 13th and the 14th, right now it's uh, the afternoon. Let's see, it's 12 in the morning. It's in the afternoon right now of the uh, 12th. Afternoon of the 12th right now. So this is the forecast map right now, the 12th and the 13th. Uh, pretty high risk down here near Kumamoto in the far north near Hokkaido. And then on the 13th to the 14th, it gets even higher risk up in Hokkaido. And we could see a 5.5 earthquake up in uh, far northeastern Japan and Hokkaido here. And there's a pretty high risk here near Tokyo as well in uh, Shizuoka. But the highest risk, we could get a moderate earthquake here and uh, a, a stronger earthquake up in the north near Hokkaido on the 13th and 14th. All right, so let's go back to the uh, uh, forecast for Los Angeles. We showed in the video yesterday, if you want to check, take a look at the video yesterday, we uh, had very high risk in this area here. I think it was uh, like 49 units uh, northwest of LA. I believe it was on the, uh, the, toward the end of September. And uh, so we were concerned about that. And then all we got was like a 3.7 on uh, the 1st of October on the Garlock Fault there. Now this risk is up to like 56 units of risk, 56 variance level. And um, so now it's even a, a greater risk. So we're looking for a major earthquake northwest of Los Angeles during the next 48 hours or so. And again, the most likely time is right here on the uh, 13th in the morning. But this quake could happen any time between now and the evening of the 13th. But most likely uh, the morning of the 13th. But any time between now, uh, the 12th and the 13th is when this large earthquake is going to happen northwest of LA. So again, if you have any friends or family that live in that area, Please uh, warn them. Uh, this forecast model is working really well now in, uh, in Tokyo. Um, we had forecasted a strong earthquake near Tokyo and they got a 5.9 there. The risk level was uh, maxing out in, in Anchorage and they got a 6.9 there. Uh, this for forecast model is working quite well. So um, be sure to warn friends and family of this strong earthquake coming to the LA Ridgecrest and Koalinga area, most likely northwest of LA along the Garlock Fault. All right. And let's just take a look at all the quakes real quick here. So things are pretty quiet right now in uh, California, but that's usually what happens just before a significant earthquake, it gets very quiet. And, uh, and then boom, it hits. So looking for that quake to happen very soon, uh, northwest of LA, most likely in the morning of the 13th, but any time between now and then. Thanks again to uh, 100 and, almost 170,000 followers now uh, in Japan and Italy and across the world, uh, California on Twitter, Facebook and YouTube. Thank you very much to every one of you. Uh, 170,000 followers. Thank you very much. It's been 16 years of research and we continue to improve on our forecast models and uh, looking for a strong earthquake northwest of LA. So please be prepared for that. And we'll talk to you tomorrow with some more information. Thank you so much.